Good morning. How are you? Sarah? Yes. Hey, hey, I'm good. How are you? I'm awesome. Thank you. Uh, good to uh, good to talk to you again. Right on. Yeah, we've been, uh, when was the last time we chatted? A little while ago. It was a while with, ago. Yeah, it was, was uh, quite some time ago, but it was still a... Uh, tour, right? It was. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, exactly. Very cool. So uh, how you been doing? Oh, good. Just busy uh, trying to keep up with all the spinning plates, you know? Oh, I can imagine. Yeah, but it's really, really been great. First off, congratulations, of course, on the new album. Oh, thank you very much. That's huge. Now, um, how long have you guys been working on wheels? Oh, gosh, uh, probably about a year, you know. We've just okay. been taking our time with it. Nothing, we haven't had a big rush or anything, so it's been fun. It's been really a, a great process. Pretty pretty laid back, you know. Who's the, done the majority of the songwriting on those? Uh, I would think, I guess I have, okay. um, just because I'm kind of that guy. I like to, I really enjoy the, that part of it, and I just, I, I have a place in Nashville, so I'm, I'm kind of back and forth there a lot, right? Mm -hmm. It's just kind of what I do. I mean, it's just I'm, that's kind of my role, I think, in the band is kind of to, to, to stir up stuff and say, okay, let's go, uh, let's write this or let's try this, you know? Right. Well, that's awesome. Now, I uh, so it took about a year. Now, is that about average for an album? Is that, or is that? Yeah, I think uh, so. Yeah. It, it takes as long as it takes, kind of thing, you know. It's not like uh, there's no set in stone. Mm -hmm. So it's 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 what it is. But it, man, it's been uh, it's been a uh, I guess it's one of those processes where if we don't feel like we're really, really digging these tunes, we're not super excited about it, then we don't do it. Oh, okay. And, uh, and so I think on this record, it was really extra important for us to get to the point where we felt like we loved the tunes so much uh, that they were worthy of putting out for Hammer fans. Because you know, we have lots of people out there that have the Roadhammer ta logo tattooed on them. So, yeah. I mean, they set the bar for us. I mean, if they don't like it, then we got a problem, and uh, <laughs> we want to make sure that, that true, dedicated fans will, will dig what we're doing. Yeah, no doubt. You, you want to take your time and make sure that what you're putting out is your Not best. Much. Yeah, and, and the cool part is the record labels have changed so much. I mean, uh, people find what they like uh, mm -hmm. through social media. So if it's not good, I mean, they just, there's no need for them to, to, to stay with it. And um, I think that the that's a great thing because it, it ups everybody's game. And they're like, well, we really need to need to bring your A game every time because there's no there's no wall between the artist and the and the fan anymore. Yeah. I mean, they'll give you immediate feedback on what they're digging and what they're not, which is really important. Yeah. No, it's true. They were not shy about uh, voicing their opinions. On, yeah, uh, and they shouldn't be. I mean, because they're. You know, I, I'm in the business because I love music, and so are you. And mm -hmm. and I mean, that's just what we're into. So yeah. uh, we know what's what's good, and uh, we know what's great. And you want to be great, so you want to put your best foot forward. Absolutely, that's great. Now, is there any particular song in the album that like you're <sighs> really proud of, or is this just a compilation of? All of your pride uh, and joy. Like your, it's like kids, right? If you had 10 kids, you love them all for different reasons. <laughs> yeah. That's kind of how it is. But I, I think that uh, Wheels, the title track, is kind of indicative of, of what the album's about. It's not just about trucks. It's about everything from two wheels to mudding to all that, right? Yeah. And the song just says, you know, there's something about wheels that just we kind of, as people, really are attracted to that getting away kind of thing. But I really like doing remakes as well. I mean, all the, the original stuff is fun, but we're known for hammerizing tunes. And, yeah. and I think that um, I've Been Everywhere by Hank Snow came out really great. Mm -hmm. It was like the original rap song or something. There's so many sounds <laughs> in that thing. So yeah. But it's it's been great. It's been a fun record and uh, even more fun to get together with the guys and, and play you know live. It's it's uh, it's got a lot of energy. Where there's no there's absolutely no way we'll replicate that energy live. But <laughs> you know. There's just not enough caffeine in the world, but uh, <laughs> we'll try. No doubt. That's uh, that's awesome. Now, obviously, um, Get On Down the Road was the first single, which uh, yeah. was quite successful for you. I mean, tons of people love that song. I mean, it's just one of those fun songs that, you know, you want to roll down the windows and you want to crank it up because it's just uh, a fun kind of summery tune. And yeah, it's fun. Yeah, it is fun to play live. It's, it's cool to crank in the car as well. Yeah. yeah. And then, of course, Mud was uh, the last uh, single from it that uh, before you released it. Now, uh, that song, everybody up here loves that song because they can all relate to it, <laughs> especially, you know, up here in the north because, you know, the guys all work out in the oil patch and there's tons of mud, especially. And covered in mud. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's exactly, yes. And uh, so it's all, we get a lot of requests for that one because, uh, you know, they can relate to it because that's. That's their way of life. All right, on. You know, that's cool. Yeah, whether they're working in it or playing in it. But yeah, that was a that's been a very popular one for us up here. Oh, that's um, awesome. Yeah. Now, of course, uh, when was the last uh, when was the last Roadhammers album? How long has it been since you guys released uh, I something? I think five years for the um, 
probably five years for the album and probably three years since we played together last. Wow, three years, eh? Yep. And then yep. you guys are touring this summer. Yes, we've got all our festivals, uh, really great run of festivals all booked and, and just added a couple more here. So, And then we've got a great tour coming up for the fall. And this is actually pretty cool because we're, we're calling it Bands on the Run Tour. Nice. And so we're putting three bands on it. We've got a couple of our favorite bands, which is Blackjack Billy and uh, our buddies from uh, Manitoba, Doc Walker. So mm-hmm. it's going to be quite the uh, loud and awesome event. But we'll be announcing the actual dates for that, which are going to be November, December kind of thing, uh, in just a couple of weeks. So it's a busy year, but, um, you know, we've been, we've been gearing up for it, and this is fans have been the best. If it's not for the fans, then we're just doing a rehearsal. So they're the ones that make it a show. <laughs> and, um, and we're really looking forward to that. Because everybody says, what is it about the hammers that, you know, makes the show so good and stuff? It's like, no, no. It's actually the Hammer fans, and, you know, we just kind of are the soundtrack to their party, and that's what we want to be. That's awesome. Now, you guys are going to be, I think right now, the closest date that you have to be with us or be near us is uh, at, a, at Bud Country. Oh, okay. Yeah, because okay. you guys are playing Bud Country at the end of uh, June. Well, at the end of this month, I guess, at the end yeah, of this yeah, month. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. And that's cool. So you just said your tour is going to include Doc Walker and Blackjack Billy, and both of those bands are also playing at uh, yep. Evergreen Park in Grand Prairie. Yep, different days. But, mm-hmm. uh, yeah, it's, it's actually uh, great. Well, Alberta is just one of the best provinces to play in B.C. and just all the western provinces, and it's um, it's kind of a... Kind of a treat, you know, like I, I grew up a little bit in Alberta when I was young mm-hmm. in Camrose, and so it's always good to get out west again. Have you guys ever played uh, Bud Country before? Oh, yeah, a okay. few years ago, but it's uh, it's going to be good to get back. So I went to it last year and had a blast, so I've been uh, trying to promote it as thoroughly as possible and because it is just a really fun weekend. And if you like country music, you're going to have a great time kind of yeah, thing. That's yeah, sort of where exactly. I'm going from. Like, even if... You don't drink or whatever. If you like, if you like the music, then you're going to enjoy yourself. So. Oh yeah, music's the drug, mm-hmm. it's, and it's a good thing. You know, it's it's good for you. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, that's awesome. So, when are you guys officially kicking off your summer dates? Then is that is Bud Country going to be one of your first ones? Winnipeg. We start there on the twentieth, and uh, yeah, we go we roll from there. Oh, and that's going to take you through the summer. Yeah. Yeah. That's absolutely. Great. That's awesome. Well, uh, I won't take up too much more of your time here, but I uh, just oh, want to say you uh, the time. no problem. I appreciate you uh, giving me a call, and of course, best of luck with the album. I look forward to listening to it uh, in entirety here because, as I said, I, I've been loving what I'm hearing so far, so I'm just going to take a minute and uh, sit down and listen to the whole thing. Because, awesome. Uh, okay, you got to listen to it in your car because that's what it was built for, but okay. we're not paying for any speeding tickets. I will, uh, I'll keep you updated on that situation. Just the rule. <laughs> All right, sounds <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thanks so much, Jason. You take yeah. care. Talk to you soon. Bye. You now. too. Bye-bye.